My name is Erica Watts. Um, I am the stroke coordinator here at Good Sam. May is Stroke Awareness Month and I wanted to talk to you guys about all things stroke. So a stroke occurs when oxygen and nutrients, which are carried by the blood vessels, are blocked or um, when the blood vessel bursts, those oxygen and nutrients are then not delivered to that part of the brain. So when that happens, brain cells die. So FAST is an acronym for facial drooping, arm weakness, slurred speech, and time. We want you to think fast, especially when you feel like you are experiencing a stroke or noticing when someone is having a stroke. Stroke is treatable, um, but the faster that you can come here to the hospital, the faster we can treat it. Having a healthy lifestyle, such as eating well, um, not smoking, being very active, will all play a part in preventing um, from, you ha from having a stroke. So if you do have a family history of stroke, it does increase your chances of having a stroke, but making lifestyle, healthy lifestyle choices such as eating well, exercise, not smoking, all play in favor to you not having a stroke. So stroke is treatable and it's beatable. So if you come to the hospital immediately, we can treat you. Good Sam is a primary stroke center. Um, we were given this title by the American Heart Association and Joint Commission, which we wear proudly. A stroke is an, the fifth leading cause of death and the number one debility in the United States. So coming to the hospital immediately would increase your chances of not having such limited or lasting debility. So since we are a primary stroke center, we didn't just stop at receiving that title. We are always looking to improve our services. And so we've partnered up with University of Louisville and the providers there beam into this robot and they can help take care of our stroke patients. So if you come in with stroke-like symptoms, we call them immediately. You're as activated as a stroke alert and they see you within 15 minutes. You can't beat that. And then they determine if you are having a stroke, possibly other neuro neurological issues, but this way we could just rule out that you're having a stroke. And then if you're admitted to the hospital, they will follow you through all the way to your discharge. So if you have any questions in regarding stroke, um, you could always visit our GSH website, gshvin.org, and look at Stroke Services page. If you have any questions, you can just even call me at 812-885-3930.